everybody, so I thought I would do a haul today because I haven't really posted one in a while and I'm actually pretty excited about this one because I purchased everything at a dollar store named Dollar Tree and as most of you guys know, everything in this store is a dollar a piece. So the first thing that I purchased, which I was actually pretty surprised to find these, is fine glitter. And I know how expensive fine glitter can be because at Michael's, it can easily go... Um, four to six dollars for a 12 pack of samples so these come in six packs so I bought the blue and green shades and it actually comes with a pretty decent amount of glitter in each pack and I also purchased the pink red and the purple shades they had four different packs so they had the whites and silvers and they also had the blacks and browns but I was just running low on these two so I purchased those two and probably next time I'll get the other two the next thing I purchased was a 24-pack of shot cups, and I bought these because I really want to start deco denning again, so these would make really good cups for, like, Sundays or little drinks. Next, I bought a 24-pack of these party doilies, and this one has, like, an oval design, and I thought these would be really cute for, like, a background or when I take a picture and I could just place the item on top of it. So they look like this. The next thing I bought is a journal so I can keep track of like video ideas and like purchases and it has a pink background and a little birdie and the front cover says journal and it has some other little birdies and this one is one of those little tie notebooks so it has a little string that you just untie and it opens up so it has a regular basic line notebook paper but the lines are hot pink The next thing I purchased was a pack of super glue because I ran out of them. So this one is called Future Glue, but it's by the same brand, Super Glue. And the only difference is that it works on all surfaces. The next few things I bought are cupcake related items because I really want to make a cupcake tutorial. So the first thing that I got are the cupcake tins. I was actually also pretty surprised to find this because these cupcake tins can actually be pretty expensive. So this one has enough compartments for six cupcakes. And I also bought the baking cups. So these have little balloons on the outside and these are like the large size. And it also came with these little um, toothpicks and they have little balloon pictures attached to them. So it's supposed to be like a little flag. So you can just place these on top of the cupcake. The next thing I got are these loot bags. So it came with a pack of 40 and it also comes with a little tie. I thought these would be nice to put little items inside and just package things. Next I got some other baggies and I can rarely find baggies that are smaller than 2x3. So um, I found these and I think these are 2 half by one and a half, and they also had 2 by 2s So these are actually a pretty small size. They look like this and I'll probably be packaging little things in here. The next thing I bought is for my Etsy, so I was trying to find little boxes so I can package like my orders in there. So they have a blue ribbon wrapped around them and it's a clear box that opens up. So it came with a three pack. Next thing I bought are some baby wipes. So this can actually be really really nice when you want to make sure that your hands are clean before um, any color that stains a lot. And it comes with a pack of 70 and it has like a little Snoopy theme. The next thing I purchased were these decorative accents and I was actually really happy to find these there. So I got the bottle of it and these are like clear crystal balls that store and releases water. So these are the flowers that I got for the vase. So I got these ones and they start off with like a pink color and end with a white. I got these white ones and these are completely white and have some little pink on the inside. And lastly I got these and these are my favorite and they have like an inner white and then end with the pink and they also have some fuzzy pink insides. And the base that I got for them is a regular plain base and it's just a clear glass one. And to go next to the frame, I found this really, really cute um, picture. It says Tranquility and it has like some little birds and a butterfly on it. And it has this really, really nice vintage outer frame and it also has a regular black frame to it. And the last thing that I purchased were these novelty erasers. So I kind of just found these randomly sitting where the back to school supplies are. So. There is like a dango, some green tea. So I was trying to track down where these came from and this was like the only one that I could find so I just bought this one. Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing a part 2 to my haul video because I went to the post office and picked up my Bredo package which I've been waiting for a few days to come. So everything came in this bag so I'm just going to go ahead and just put everything on the floor.
All of these items are going to be on my store on me, which I opened up a few days ago. So all of my squishies are going to be listed on there. And I'll put a link to, um, to the store in my description box. So the first thing that I got is a Bredo Slice of Love. And it's actually really, really big. And it's a towel that you can design using some fabric paint. And I also got these Bredo keychains. So I got six different designs for the keychain. So there is this one. This X face, this happy face, this other X face, um, a smiley face, and this excited face. So again, these are all going to be listed on my store MB. So I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video. And before I leave, I was wondering what type of video would you guys like to see next? Because I have a room tour slash craft area tour in my mind or either a cookie earring tutorial. So just let me know which one you guys would like next. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thanks for watching. Bye!